What's up and welcome to the next episode of Freak Eating vs. The World. Today we got the Cock and Bull Challenge. And no, it's not what you think it is. Cock and Bull is a company, a brand, that makes ginger beer. And if you've never had ginger beer, it really burns the hell out of the back of your throat as you're swallowing it. Kind of a really weird soda. Ginger beer is not alcoholic, so it's kind of similar to root beer in that they got beer in the name, but no beer in it. Yeah. So I figured an 8-pack is a way to go, because I didn't see any challenges on YouTube of someone trying 8 cock and bull ginger beers. So with no further fanfare, no BS, no stalling, let's just get down to business and see how quickly I'm able to put down 8 of these. And of course, it's also going to test my dexterity to use a bottle opener. Let's see. Oh, see? Told you this is gonna be crazy. And one cap on the floor, bottle in my hand. So let's go. Ow! Oh. Yeah, ginger does burn the hell out of your mouth and your throat. I remember the first time I drank one of these, it was like fire in the back of my throat. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's almost as bad as the sensation of eating hot peppers. <laughs> the burning sensation is a strong one, Charlie Brown. <sighs> Excuse me. Number three. They're also very highly carbonated. I'm actually not right-handed. Maybe I should try the thing with my left. Excuse me, I gotta, I gotta make room. It burns like fire! <clears throat> I don't know whose bright idea it was to make ginger <clears throat> into, a, into a soda, but I am not a member of that fan club. Number five. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ugh. Oh, my throat hurts. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think I got a sore throat going on over here. Ah. Ah. Oh, it hurts. Oh, it hurts. Uh, 
Gotta clear it out. All the carbonation is just off. Taking up stomach room here. Okay. Okay. Number six. This has to be the most carbonated soda that I've ever drank in my life, especially in mass quantity. Okay, six down. Excuse me, on all those accounts. Thor is burning. And it's mind over natter time, number seven. Oh no, just gotta power it through, power down. I am not enjoying this in the least. Remember the first time I drank a ginger beer, I was not expecting it to burn. <clears throat> and I always thought to myself, you know, drinking a bunch of these would be a great challenge. And it's a great challenge because it's really stupid. <clears throat> and I'm regretting this big time. I see my throat is becoming irritated. Oh. oh, I feel nasty. <laughs> Combination and that ginger taste is popping up into my nose. <laughs> oh, Ugh. last one, last one. I can, I can just look in the rear view, rear view mirror. And put this, put this nastiness behind me. Here we go. Bottle eight, eight out of eight, eight ginger beers in the cock and bull challenge. Here we go. Ah, it hurts. Oh, it hurts bad. <laughs> and it tastes nasty. One more swig. No fooling. No fanfare, no BS, no stalling. I just done the cock and bull challenge. Eight ginger beers as quickly as possible has been completed. Oh. The aftertaste of the ginger is overwhelming right now. It just tastes Disgusting. My throat's burning. With every with every drink, with every like bottle, it just got worse and worse. 
My throat feels like I had just ate a bunch of peppers. I feel like it's irritated. I feel like I got a sore throat coming on. I really hope I don't. But it's all in the name of freak eating science. We're gonna find out what happens when someone does a really dumbass thing and drinks a bunch of ginger beers. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. And if you have, please click that thumbs up button. Subscribe to Freak Eating and stay tuned because I got new and more eating challenges coming up every week. And if you have a suggestion for a challenge idea you'd like to see, because I know I'm, I, I'm on summer vacation, so I have more time to do things, more time to plan things. And so I'm always looking out for new and crazy things to try. And I will see all of you in the next video. So until we eat again, or drink again, stay in school, don't do drugs, and eat like a freak.